this is a demo of the latest 5-axis 3 plus 2 rotor coat. I've got an example mold. It's a 6 inch by 6 inch platform with the letter A on it. The configuration properties are grouped into the bed. Some orientation settings. The router dimensions, some of them are saved and pulled in, and but most of them are not being used. And I'm going to generate the toolpath with finishing. C and B, and enter 35, and let it generate an example toolpath. We wouldn't normally use this angle on the shape, but it's just a test. So it's resolving collisions. Right now it's running through the toolpath. And it gives us this G code. So each toolpath will have the um, the run, which is the finishing three plus two, and then the B and C and accuracy values. So we're going to run this on the machine. We're not going to use the spindle this time. So the spindle is turned off, but we just want to make sure that the code runs and that the axes move. Read the G code and the spindle is disabled. So I'm going to cut to a video of the machine running and follow up later. Is it moving to 55? Yeah, okay, so it's moving in the Z and the B and the C right now. Mm -hmm. So I think that... Oh, it is moving. Because... <laughs> yeah. The feed rate is probably too low. Because I'm setting the F for each line, and it was just a random... Yeah. Um... 30 inches per minute. Well, I'm, I'm, I think it's a map. I think it's like the... Because the Z is like... The speed of the Z is limited. What does this mean? What does this mean? What does this mean? Okay, as long as. I'm trying to think about how to fix that. So the part, it's doing a crisscross. Jerky? Yeah. Um, did you like decrease the step size or was like, did you affect, did you change? I guess you didn't. No, it's that. just the orientation of the okay. coordinates. And there are things I can do. I think it does slow down when it changes velocity, but it's not moving fast enough for that to make much mm -hmm. of a difference. This is good learning. I'm just recording so that I can look at it later. I think that. I just increased the speed yeah. by double. So it's going to be making, um, it's like a square, mm -hmm. what, six inches by six inches with the letter A in the center. Mm -hmm. So there it's doing part of, yeah. I can't really see the X movement from this angle, but it looks like it's doing mm -hmm. what it's supposed to yeah, do. Yeah, I can kind of see the, the pattern. You can sort of see the pattern on here. And the, um, it won't match the contour perfectly because sometimes it pulls up, especially where it detected a collision, it pulls back extra far. So it'll look a bit like a mountain range. Sweet. Hmm. Yeah, I wonder, because like whenever, like I can see, I see it like going from line to line to line to line, like I yep. can see it pretty easily, and whenever I run G-code generated from Fusion, it's kind of just usually like, just 
like running super fast. It, so. Do you know what the uh, feed rate is? I said inches. I don't think it's necessarily the feed rate. I think it's the like telling like say the X to go from one to one point one or like one to one point oh five or mm -hmm. one to one point oh one. Yep. I think that's what we need to so just to increase the just reduce the space between each point i think so okay there must be like a i can do that pretty easily yeah the um the thing i wanted to test here was does it look does it run and then secondly does it look like it's moving in a way that actually is cutting the part and it looks i think it looks like it is without cutting anything I can see like I can see a picture on the, on the screen here that, Sweet. of like the tool path and it looks right. It's a little bit like it's kind of a little bit tapered. It's kind of an yeah shape because it's pointing at thirty five degree. I mean, yeah. well, and the machine doesn't know the machine doesn't know the length of the the yeah. fulcrum yet. So, like, if the picture looks like remotely like what the part is, I think that's yeah. Good. Cool. Okay, we don't have to run the full thing. That's okay. excellent. <clears throat>